Oh, William. Let's do an astrological check and prediction on this guy. Now remember, I do side real astrology, so don't look at his sun sign and go, he's not this, he's not that. What I really find is most important is the aspects to the planets are in the sky right now, up against his chart, and that's how we're going to see where his future and destiny lies. Will he be king soon? So first of all, he is the communicator, but he's not confident on how he communicates. In fact, he's always had a problem with authority, and it's not easy for him to be put in an authoritative position. Money and finances are extremely important. I don't see that he is the actor. He is not a liar. However, he's easily manipulated. He's easily programmed because he doesn't have his own natural sense of self-confidence. The connection between his mom and dad together was extremely important. He needed to know that his mom and dad were on the same page growing up. And obviously we know that didn't happen. Now, regardless of whether you believe that he's actually on the cusp uh, in Western, but in um, side real astrology, he is a Gemini with a Gemini moon. So that's a double Gemini. That's a very inquisitive, questioning person. He will be used as the deliverer of information in which he wants globally, they want globally the world to hear. There'll come a point where you're going to wonder, is he a journalist? Why is he spreading all of this news, facts, or information, or disinformation? Anyhow, let's get to the predictions of the future of Prince William. With Neptune right up against the Ascendant, it shows that there's a sense of false identity, and he will be represented with false identity. That's the classic imposter syndrome. Oh, by the way, if I, he was just a regular everyday Joe and I saw this, I would say it's abandonment syndrome from both his mom and his dad, and there's a complete mystery to what happened to either or of them. And since it's a 12th house, it's also relating to death. So to look when he's going to be crowned, we're going to look at Jupiter and Uranus. We want it to go where Chiron is, and then eventually when the world will know, and this will be here. So let's see when that's going to happen. He will know about it in June 2024, when Uranus goes into Taurus. The world will know about it in May of 2025. Complete in January and February of 20.